Girls. Girls. Yeah. <laughs> we did the first interview last... Two years ago. Two My years ago. Like and last year we did in the coffee shop. Yes. So now we make both of you. <laughs> <laughs> so right. how is Book of Bank? It's very good. Actually, we are watching on TV and at the games, but how is the team? How are you guys? You want to start? Who is going to answer? Whatever, you can go. go ahead. Better English than you <laughs> answer in Turkish. I can answer in Turkish. Ah, okay. Actually, you I can. can try. Yeah. Okay. okay, I'll do English. Things are great. Um, team is really good. We like have a really good group of girls, obviously, and we really like each other. And we're practicing hard and practicing a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good. Really? Bence de. <laughs> <laughs> hey! No. During the interview, you'll talk in Turkey. You talk in Turkish. You can't talk in Turkish. Actually, not really. I'm trying, really. I'm trying so hard. And also, my teammates have started talking half half with me just to, to learn it uh, quicker. But I'm giving my best. Actually, I know some of Turkish, but not really good. <laughs> not really good, but. But pretty good. Yeah, they said it's pretty good, but I don't think so. Well, I don't so know now, anything. <laughs> The Champions League and the league is going on, and now you are going to play against Waller Azuri. How do you see your chance? Let's say we'll start with you. Then. I guess that uh, this season we have a really good team, and that actually we have really huge chances. And uh, Waller is also a strong team that we have to prepare really good to play against them. And also we had a chance to play against them the same. I think quarterfinal was last last season. And uh, it was not an easy game at all, so I hope we're going to prepare really good uh, and to play this, these two matches on the really high level. So, with you, I, I was going to ask, like, I always say that after the Olympics, it's really hard to get concentrate to the club teams. And actually, we see that in Vakuf Bank and also in Fenerbahce and Ezajabasu because this three team has lots of players who played Olympics. What do you think? Like you played the Olympics and you came to Turkey to play the club team. Is it really hard to get concentrate and also as the performance wise, is it hard to get to, to the level that you used to? I think it's kind of normal to, to lose that focus at the end of the national team season, especially after the Olympics, that was a, the biggest competition. And uh, of course, it's a good thing that we have some, some days off after the Olympics and then we have time to, to come back to the club and to focus again on all the things that are coming up. So, uh, and otherwise, we are, we are used to it. So it's not like the first time that we, we are changing the teams in like 10 days. Oh, so it doesn't make any difference between the European Championship and the World Championship? Yeah, all the every big competition is important. So. <laughs> good answer. Yeah. For me, it's difficult. <laughs> But after the Olympics, I don't know, it's something, I don't know, like you're training for for so long and then when it's over, you like you feel like you need to breathe or something and then you're immediately here, you know? And the beginning of the season was a little difficult for me, but then once... You're just getting used to it. Yeah, you get used to it and you're training more and then it becomes easy. It's just the, maybe the first month you're like, oh my gosh, I'm tired, you know? Yeah. <laughs> but so that when, is fine. When you say, okay, oh my God, it, I'm tired and I'm really bored of volleyball, what do you guys do? It happens sometimes. Right? It happens What do you do? I don't what know. I <laughs> we just, I know, just keep training. You just keep going. Keep practicing. Yeah, yeah, and eventually practicing. it comes back, I yeah. think. And by the moment you just lose the feeling. Right? Yeah. Is there any day that you don't think about volleyball or the the, the court, the team, the day coach? <laughs> I'm trying Try to, not to. to not think about volleyball, really, yeah. and, and it helps a lot. Yeah. Okay, today you are thinking about all the ball stuff, David. Yeah, thank I'm you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, okay yeah. yeah. So now you said that the friendship in Vakuf Bank is really good. Like from outside, we always say that Vakuf Bank is like a family. So now this year, there are newcomers to the team. Actually, Zutin. Zutin. Zutin. Zutin. Zutin. So the, to, to have a Chinese teammate, <laughs> yeah, this kind of funny situation. And especially at the start of the season, that she she couldn't speak any English, so we had to use our body language to understand each other, you know. And especially on the court, when you have to explain something and about tactic and blah blah blah. But uh, I think that she's getting better now, and that she knows a lot more English. And that's a good thing. So you play in the same position, yes, with her, yes. So, her system, because Chinese system, national team system is really different than the, the European and American ones. So, is it too much different? Uh, I think in the beginning it was a little bit difficult transitioning for her, but now it's good. But 
I think Giovanni had to tell her some things a lot of times to, you know, get it, get it in her mind. But now it's fine. But it's funny. <laughs> it's funny at the beginning. Certain things, yeah. You, when we. I don't remember who. I am really getting off track to that. Interviews anymore. <laughs> we were talking about the middle blockers. I think it was Chicho Chida. I don't know if you know her, but it's a Turkish ex volleyball player okay. national. Uh, it was a manager of Fenerbahce before. Okay. Uh, we were talking about the middle blockers and how their performance. Sorry, I should say that uh, because Milana is in Vakufbank, all the young middle blockers getting better. So, do you really teach them during the practice? Um, you are you are telling about middle blockers in Vakuf right now. No, no, I'm talking about you being in Wakuf Bank and teaching to the young players yeah, how to yes. do block or how to do attack from middle. Actually, um, Giovanni told me one thing that I should be kind of a coach for middle block. <laughs> first moment I was like, I cannot do that. But I'm trying really to, to, to help them with the things that I can see at the moment. Like, uh, you're opening the block too much, you're late there, stay there, I don't know. There's a lot of really lot of things about middle blockers. I'm trying so hard, but sometimes it's just like I cannot be a coach. I'm just a player. <laughs> it's difficult. Is it, it difficult. so much different to teach something and to do something yeah. in the court? Yeah. But it's funny how many things you can see outside the court, mm -hmm. and actually you are doing the same things, but you don't feel it. It's totally different when you're watching it outside the court and when you are inside the court. It's like automatic. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So the Turkish kitchen. Turkish food. I think it's same like Serbians. Similar, yeah. Yeah? yeah For you, it's so much different. Yes. <laughs> so which one do you like the most? Like? Oh, I like almost everything. I think all the meats are really good. You have a lot of really good meat. I don't know. I love meze. Like so yeah, I like. Yeah, I like all. She food. doesn't look like she. Like, I know. She's she's <laughs> she's <lucky. laughs> I think she's good lucky. genes, good genetics. I like food though. So like when when you are off, like today is off day, and if there is no interview, if there is not Burju called you and say okay, <laughs> let's do the interview. <laughs> what will Kim and Rasic will do? If it's a sunny day, then we can choose between a lot of things. But if it's a rainy day like this, we can just go to the shopping mall for some lunch. Juice. Yeah. Just going to cinema maybe. Yeah. Or just staying in the couch and watching movies. <laughs> Sometimes it's like that, yeah. But when it's sunny day, actually last last day off, it was really nice weather. So we just uh, took our blanket and we went to Moda. Where all the people are sitting in the Yeah, grass. I saw only Instagram. Yeah, yes. it was yes. Instagram. Yeah. And uh, we had their music, we were reading the books and just sitting there, it was really nice. Well, what do you so listen? Nice. What kind of music? I, that moment I was playing, uh, I think, Serbian radio, but with the house music. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs> it was not Serbian music. <laughs> but everything, everything. Yeah. Everything, yeah, like, you, know, you like, don't have, a, like, a favorite group or... No, we are just playing radio, so... I like a lot of stuff. I like a lot of um, hip-hop and R&B, maybe. Oh, American. Typical, yeah. But I like everything. Uh, do do you us. sing in the locker rooms? <laughs> Some of us do, but we're not good. <laughs> what we sing in the locker room stays there because we're too embarrassed to sing outside <laughs> of the locker room, maybe. Because everybody, yeah, all the volleyball Every players. Every time someone starts singing, we are like volume up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's true. So if you want, we'll go and choose our mezes, Turkish mezes. This is a really special moment because we are going to choose it from the best chef of Turkey, from Arda. And I, don't, I think you are going to taste uh, different methods. Never tasted before. Oh, I'm excited. Ready? OK, let's go. OK, let's go. Oh, hoş geldiniz ya. Hoş bulduk. Hi, girls. How are you? Good, thank you. Thank you. Would you like to prefer in speaking in Turkish or Turkish. Uh, in English? I heard that you talk. <laughs> yeah, I, I heard that you talk <laughs> Turkish <laughs> perfectly. OK. Let's go like this. So, so, do you want to try new things or? Yes. Okay, we have uh, 40 different type of meze oh. in this restaurant. <laughs> 40. Oh, and, yeah. uh, so you have to choose. <laughs> you, you, you have to choose, so I'll arrange something for you. Okay. Um, I don't know what kind of uh, dishes you like or not, but I'll explain all of them. If uh, something's wrong with you, we can change it or 
you can show me whatever you want and I can explain everything, okay? Okay. So this one is quince. Uh, it's a fruit actually, but uh, in Turkish cuisine we love to cook um, fruit as well as a dish. Mm. So uh, this one is uh, uh, anise inside um, and different spices. It's very tasty. Uh, this is artichoke and we oh. love artichoke a lot in Turkey and it's very healthy and it's good for you. Very healthy as well. vegetable. Oh, okay. <laughs> and um, uh, this one is also very uh, traditional and it's also in my book, uh, as Burcu will know. Yes. And this is called Topik. <laughs> it's filled with um, caramelized onion inside and um, um, small raisins. And mm -hmm. the, the upper part is tahini and chickpea puree. And we form that as a meatball like this. And when you cut it, it's filled with a very tasty inside. And this is esme, it's um, tomato-based uh, meze, served with pomegranate molasses. Okay. And this is half um, spice, spicy as hot, but so half sour, half uh, sugary. It's, it, it has a different taste that, um, I don't know you like it or not, but we all love this one. <laughs> and this is called mutabel, uh, it's eggplant. Uh, we put the eggplant in a special oven and we cook them at least one and a half hour and uh, it's, it has a char grill taste inside and we beat it, the, we beat the eggplant to make it a puree and we add tahini inside, a little bit of lemon juice and a little bit of olive oil. I think you're gonna love it if you like the, the char grill taste. And uh, this, one, this one is Muhammara, we can eat it in breakfast as well. We put it in the bread like this and we can eat it in breakfast in all day meze. It's, I think you're gonna love it. Uh, it has some uh, nuts inside, a little bit of um, tomato puree, uh, tomato paste, and um, some uh, nuts. That's all. But if you have anything to taste from this parts, I can explain to you. You ask okay, me. The, the, the problem is, <laughs> okay. she, she doesn't. She doesn't right? eat vegetables. She, you doesn't. Yeah. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's weird, yes, but uh, don't worry about it. Uh, I'll order some um, meat for you. Yeah, yeah, of course. You're gonna have some three, three different types of meats. Uh, it, one, if, one of them will be a liver, very special uh, uh, dish of my restaurant. And the other one is lamb neck. It's cooked six and a half hour to make it so tender. And it's like a meatball also. We form as a meatball. And um, let's make another third one. I'll, I'll, I'll, I'll choose one of them. So you are the first uh, person uh, I met <laughs> literally who don't eat vegetable and who want to eat meat. Great to hear that, by the way. So how do you live without the vegetables? I really have no idea. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> but actually, uh, it's not that I don't eat vegetables. Eat some kind of food like melamine. I love melamine when there is tomato also, but like tomato, tomato mm. I cannot eat. I cooked tomato. Yeah, you cooked can. Maybe you can yeah. try the. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> so, Mamara. any other one? You are curious Do about you wanna it? Check if you want the other ones. You I eat think fish. She is gonna be the one who's gonna try. <laughs> you eat fish? I'll be the. I can eat fish. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll go with the meat for you. So if you want, we'll try the the best chef of Turkey. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can we take the? İstersen siz geçin ben getireyim. İstersen sen al. Peki. Hadi al bakalım. Tamam. Hadi bakalım. İnşallah. Yürüyün bakalım. Hadi gelin bakalım. İnşallah. Maşallahla ilerliyorduk. Anam anam anam. Boya ağırmış ya. Tepsi. Etler geliyor. Meat. Etlerimiz de geldi. Hadi bakalım. Hadi bakalım. Games. Sometimes not so much. Actually, yeah, yeah really. <laughs> but you know, uh, 
are, I prefer women's volleyball to men's volleyball because in men's volleyball it's so much power and mm -hmm. the sets are so short. And points, and end, points and are not that yeah. long also. Yeah. In five seconds. A lot of but in yeah. women's volleyball it's a lot of technique and mm -hmm. hard work and stuff. Yeah, it's longer and longer. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. Like everybody. Okay. Yes. Is it, is it a common sense? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. I thought I'm I was the special. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I think everyone's doing the same. Yeah. Everybody likes women. Because they are beautiful girls. Yeah, of course. On the court. Of course. These are all really delicious. You really like it? Like, yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's real different. Very it's different, like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Turkish food is. You cannot describe in two sentences mm -hmm. because in northern, southern, eastern, western part, a lot of different kind of cooking techniques with the different ingredients. Can you believe that uh, we have a very special dessert prepared with chicken breast? Uh -huh. It's a milky dessert. It may sound weird to you, <laughs> but, really, but, really, but really, believe me, believe me, if you eat this one, You'll never forget the taste. It's really delicious. I like it. But there's there's chicken breast inside, and when you eat this dessert, it's a milky one. Uh, the end of the dessert, you get some like a gum um, in your mouth, and you said, "What's this?" And believe in, believe that. Um, no one believes. It's a yeah, 75 percent of uh, people cannot understand this chicken inside. Oh. But really. Really strange. Yeah, really I want to try it. Though. Yeah. It's called tavuk göğsü. Chicken breast. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs> we, we hope to see you in one of the volleyball games. Yeah, why not? If you invite me, I'll definitely come and watch Because it. now the Champions League uh, mm -hmm. Final Four is coming. Uh -huh. So I think they are going to be hopefully on the Final Four. And also before Final Four, they have a volleyball game. Yeah. Very important game. The all, the all interesting games are starting now, so yeah. Yes. Okay, okay waiting for the invitation, okay? Uh, yeah, you're <laughs> always welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Always. And bring this one. Pick yeah. the food. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Girls, thank you so much. Thank and you. Good luck in the Champions League also. Thank you. Thank you. And I'll see you at the games. All right. Thank okay. you. Bring thank you. So, bon appetit. Thank bon appetit. Thank you. Bon appetit. <laughs> Burada klip kıyar. Aynen. <gülüyor>